the, ma the, the matches that have not been uh, decided yet. It is so annoying. Why would they do this? It was working perfectly before this. Anyways, it's gonna be Amato versus uh, Gilgamesh. I have to update the flags, unfortunately. I'm sorry if I can't speak. Uh, right now, I have a lot of things to do preemptively. Okay, first match goes to Gilga Bear. There we go. What I used to do, uh, maybe can do the announcement sword and just yeah, but it's super annoying because I need to con constantly like pay attention to. Uh, I need to pay constantly pay attention to uh, to how how everything is going on, you know, and it cannot like continue naturally. I always have to keep an eye on the on the bracket. This is gonna be super annoying. Why would they do this? It's so dumb. Ah, uh, it's so dumb. Yeah. 
Well played for Amato. Sorry, I can I can really not uh, comment it right now. I need to do a lot of things. I'm really sorry. Well played to Amato, leading uh, two to one. Dual one. Let's rock. This is really bad. Uh, I'm so, I'm so. Yo, thanks for the follow, Lemon Lord, and welcome to the Brojo. Anyways, let's go back to the uh, tournament. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to like constantly pay. Uh, I'm going to have to constantly pay attention to uh, to the to the uh, to the tournament brackets because I cannot tell uh, individually to. Uh, the players which match is going to be streamed which match is not going to be streamed so unfortunately i have to keep an eye on the chat all the time uh, to the bracket at all time which is extremely annoying but it's like it is what it is mm. i really hope they revert it as soon as possible i really hope they revert Mix. Yeah, I, 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 uh, 
Yeah, I uh, I sent I pinged the ton of milk on Twitter. I don't know if they'll see it or not, but yeah, hopefully they will. It's super, super, super annoying. Ah. Uh, why would they do this? I have no idea. But anyways, here we go. Very nice jump in by Gilgamesh. He uses the RC to try to... Oh, he closes the distance. He's... Ah, oh, nice for RC by Amato. Finally gets out of the corner. He's on the... Ah, he's really, really close to get the kill and gets it with the close S. Good stuff by Amato. And we to update the beat. I the flags actually, because zero is not from the Republic of Kentucky Fried Chicken. <laughs> yeah, and now I have to tell also the players of round three that their matches is not streamed and they can start. Fight Sheen. Fight. Fight Sheen. Okay, here we go with the Shizuriyuki and Zero looking to try to to finish it and finishes it correctly. Very nicely done by Zero. Takes the first uh, match, the first round, quite quite uh, quite strongly actually. Let's see how this pans out. Good stuff by Hagira brings it back in the second round. Here we go with the closest and the forest. Oh, the big attempt of using the blue. Oh lord, and that burst has been baited. This is gonna be death right there. Very nicely done by Zero. Brings it back. Do I seem to bomb you out? Some tournaments have an overlay like this. Next match, X versus Y, but that would have, have taken. Yeah, but even not everybody's watching the stream, so I can't use it like this. I need to have like a. I need to have um, a feature on the platform itself, on the tournament platform itself. And right there, the the only way that I had found up until now, because they don't, they, they're not like Star DG. They don't have like a, a layout where they can explicitly say, okay, this 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 match is going to be streamed. This one is not going to be streamed. You have to like do it like individually and send messages in the in the chat. But in Tonmail, they don't have this. So what I did up until now is that preemptively, I opened already all of the matches that I was planning to. To, to, to stream basically and I sit send I sent directives in each uh, in each uh, in each chat of these these particular uh, matches that I was going to stream and I sent already saying okay this match is going to be streamed do not start your match and upon doing this every other matches I could just tell the uh, the participants okay you can start your match if if, if you don't have any like uh, if you don't have any um, uh, explanation in your individual chats 
that means that your match is not going to be streamed. And so, you know, the tournament could continue extremely, like, super smoothly without me having to check the bracket because everything was already done at the moment where I created the bracket. But right now, Tonomel made it so that you cannot send messages to to matches which the participants have not been determined. And it's extremely annoying. It's extremely... I don't know why they did it like this. Because right now, what happens is that I cannot... I can't send all of these previous messages, no preemptively. And I have to watch the... I have to watch the bracket, like, as soon as, like... One of the matches I want to stream is, is is determined. I have to immediately open it up and say, no, don't start your match. It's dumb. <laughs> I'm sorry, it is really dumb. And I really hope they're going to revert it because this is just, I don't know. It's, I, I don't know. It's it's the absence of, of it's the absence of innovation. You know, I, I don't know. It's, it's completely dumb. I don't know why they would do this. But anyways, it is what it is. Very nice wall break. Zero is going to get the positive bonus. Very nice uh, whiff punish right there on the Beyblade by Hagiara. Tries to go for the 2D to get the knockdown. There you go, Zero, making good use of the back Fukio to try to maintain the pressure. And upon doing so, since I'm checking the. Wow, and here we go with the Beyblade for the kill again. Again, Zero with the win. Takes the lead with 2 to 1. Let's see if Hagiara can bring it back or if he will decide to change characters. We shall see. Looking here with a round start with the Beyblade. Yes, Dereka forces the burst upon his opponent. Very nice back. Fukio invites the tech attempt from Hagiara and Zero on with his crazy pressure in the corner. He's gonna get... Oh no! The blood explosion! Here we go. He goes for the, uh, the quick... Oh my lord. That instant overhead right there for the kill by Zero and just like the Zero is on the verge of taking it. Let's see how this pans out. Starts the... Uh, starts around immediately with the DP. He has Agiara in the corner. Gonna get the Rekka. Uh, couldn't quite get the OTG right there. And this is going to cost him some momentum. But it's okay. He punishes the uh, odd attempt of trying to... Uh, Midi right there from Hagiara. That being said, here we go with Hagiara and the... Oh, the minion pressure. Oh, he tries to go for the grab. Unfortunately, nobody's home. Here we go with the Abare from zero. Oh, he tries to go for the jump. And unfortunately, Hagiara had it. <gasps> All... According to Keikaku, no, Lord! Zero probably tried to go for a media, unfortunately he couldn't quite get it, and Hagiara takes this opportunity to apply the corner pressure. He's gonna get the kill with the wonderful pressure of Jacko. Let's see how this pans out. A little bull so statement this it. But I definitely understand the frustration when you can't do things as you Yeah, I know, right? But I mean, if they give me an alternative to do what I used to do up until now, no problem, I'm gonna get used to it. But the thing is, with, with Tonamel, you don't have this alternative. There's no way to practically tell your 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 participants that yeah your match is going to be streamed until they they all are they're here you know so it's kind of i don't know it, it just doesn't make any sense i really hope they revert it as soon as possible like for me like if they don't do it like by the next tournament it's going to be really annoying for me to keep toing i'm not even gonna lie so i really hope they revert it it's already like annoying enough to use tonamel as it is i'd rather use star gg but you know yeah Nobody in Japan uses Star GG, so I can't really do my, my tournaments on this. Just like this Hagiara actually puts one on the board as well. <laughs> so yeah, I really hope they either like implement a feature to make it so that you can easily tell your participants that their match is going to be streamed, or uh, like an alternative. But right now, if they don't let me have access to the chat, if there's not two players in it, it's I find it, uh, it, it just defeats any purpose. It's like completely dumb in my opinion, so... Yeah, but anyways, we'll see. Hmm. That being said, here we go with Hagiara and the Abar in the 2D, man. The magic 2D of Jacko. Finally gets out of the corner, finds the opening with the RC, pushes Zero in the corner. But Zero with the good, the good awareness. The good awareness using 6 speed right there to kill the minion. Let's see, this is probably, this is a uh, set point, by the way. Let's see if Zero can... Uh, seal it out or not, but for now, Hagiara looking pretty good. Not gonna lie, he gets the corner pressure. Wow, and the 6p from zero, not afraid, man. But Hagiara answers back, checks that Fukio with the 2d, uh, the 2k2d again with the 2k2d on point with the Fukio punish. Here we go with the corner pressure. Is zero gonna press something? Yeah, zero has to hold it. He has to hold it until he has at least YRC to try to reverse, and he goes. Oh, no! 
You're going to YRC. Tries to go for the command from that cheeky, cheeky, cheeky person. No! And unfortunately, Hagiara messes with the juggle, but he reads the command grab attempt right there and punishes. Accordingly, we are going on to the final round of this final match. Who is going to take it? We shall see. Very nice jump in by Hagiara. Uh, tries to go for the grab, but unfortunately, Zero was on point and Zero already upon him. Uh, against Zareka, gonna get the corner carry, goes for the 6H. Oh, again with the- oh no! Oh, he goes for the command grab once Hagiara is in the- oh no, I'm just gonna speed back! Oh, he, no! He tried to go for the burst bait, he had the correct read, but did it a little bit too early. And because of this, the Beyblade actually whiffed. And here we go with Hagiara going with the oh knife, he's gonna get the wall break and a hard knockdown. What is gonna happen? Okay, this is- this could go either way. What is Hagiara gonna do? He goes for Dominion. Okay, he wants to play it safe. Oh no, my mind is so it's wrong with the freaking double Fuki right after the, the 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 close. That was crazy stuff by freaking. It would be so much more easier if they could freaking just send it directly. Yeah, just let me use the freaking chat for for things that for matches that have not been decided yet. It would be so much easier. Like seriously, good lord. Okay. Here we go with Koide already bringing the heat. Uh, pushes Yukinato in the corner, but Yukinato, holy freaking lord, not afraid to just go straight. Yeah, the general announcement, yeah. I'm gonna have to do this, I guess. But it's kind of really annoying, not gonna lie. Uh, and here we go with... Oh, lord! Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to do this. You're right, you're right. Oh, good lord! And here we go with the juggle, and the Koide goes for the overdrive for oh i thought it was gonna kill but not enough a little bit shy to kill right there but he goes for the kick flip for the kill good stuff by Koida takes the first round let's see how this pans out but thanks uh thanks Pokemon, for the uh for the tip that's actually I'm, I'm gonna try to yeah i'm gonna have to work for an alternative just in case you know. there's no way i'm gonna have to like do like constantly watch the bracket all the time just to uh but it's so annoying it is so annoying man Anyways, here we go with the right the lightning right there from Yukinato. He gets a kill. Good lord, with a perfect, nevertheless. Nevertheless, man, that was pretty good stuff by Yukinato. And here we go with Kohide, not afraid to bring on the heat. And Yukinato pops the DP right there. Oh, I thought that Kohide was going to go for the grab. But it's okay, he got the schmix and goes immediately for the overdrive to prevent Yukinato from using his burst. And Koide, just like this, is going to benefit from a hard knockdown. Goes for the... Oh, 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 lord. Finally, Yukinato pops the burst. Oh, he goes for that. Oh, oh, no. And he gets hit by the aerial overdrive of Koide. Koide takes the first match. Uh, pretty convincingly. Let's see how this pans out. Uh, Yukinato on point, man. Very good uh, reflexes this dude had. He really has a lot of very good reflexes. Here we go with the direct light. Ah, he goes for the grab. Kohide not ready to take this. Oh, and Kohide with the golden burst. The golden Kohide. Kohide loves them golden burst, man. He's always gonna go for them. Ah, and he tries to go for the overdrive. Unfortunately, Yukinato was already blocking. That being said, here we go with Kohide and the conversion station. Gonna get the wall uh, carry. Wow, Yukinato didn't use his RC right there. He could have made it uh, safe, actually. But he didn't believe. And that being said, Kohida takes the first round of this second match. Let's see how this pans out. Here we go with the grab. The tick grab, if I might say. The sliding grab. A uh, thing that only Giovanna can do in this game, I feel. <laughs> Anyways, here we go with the stun dippers. He's gonna get the uh, knockdown again. Oh, too far to get anything out of it. And still pops the DP, man. Yukinato not afraid. Okay, he's gonna get the Oki. It's gonna be the Oki, okay. here we go, the uh, tick pressure, and that freaking dash from Kohide from Giovanna, actually. Ooh, lord, that trade in favor of Yukinato gets the conversion with the uh, Fudra Dark. Let's see if he can manage to take this one as well. Oh, the side pressure, ooh, very nice Abare wake up right there from Yukinato. Oh, where, oh, and that 6 feet right on the cannon drill from Kohide gets the, ooh, the direct claw. Very nice back dash and that grab right there from Kohide is going for the safe jump. Forces Yukinato to pop the burst. Here we go with Kohide popping the burst himself as well. Goes for the six feet. Catches Kohide. Oh, catches back dash, but Kohide. Oh, no. That Amari couldn't quite convert right there. This is unfortunate for him. Goes for the kick flip. Okay, he's gonna get the wall. Oh, no, no, no. 
Oh, nice 6P right there from you, Kinato. Can you seal it? Can you seal it? No, too far! You don't want this, no! No, you hate to see it happen! But not that! Not that! No, and that wake up DP right there! And Koji, they're using the very, very far reaching 2D of Giovanna to make it sure that even if Yukinato woke up with the DP, it would either clash or not hit uh, Kohide at all. Very nice decision making right there from Kohide. Ah, I think Yukinato is gonna pop the Potemkin, actually. We shall see. We shall see, we shall see. Let's see how this pans out. Mm. Good lord. And we are indeed going to see the Potemkin of Yuki Nato. Let's see how this spins out. Is he going to be able to make a comeback with him? But in my opinion, like Potemkin versus Giovanna is pretty tough for for Pot. But then again, Yuki Nato not a stranger of using Pot. And here we go with the two. Oh, the two P is gonna go with the flick and gets the far S. Oh, he goes for the slider head. No one homed up. Goes for the Mega Fist, he's gonna get the counter hit. Oh, the back Mega Fist 4. Oh, Lord! Good tick pressure right there from Koyuda is gonna get the save. Oh, the save jump. Ah, and that. Yeah, Koyuda making good use of the very, very speedy Giovanna right there to go in and out of uh, Yukinato's range. Yukinato, that being Potemkin, by the way. And here we go with the tick pressure again. Yukinato a little bit uh, too far to get anything to connect. He goes for the Mega Fist, but Kohide was ready. Punishes with Dina Sante for the kill. Good stuff by Kohide. Kira kaite kita. Desu. Desu desu. But that being said, here we go. Oh, Lord, and that counter hit. This is going to do a lot of damage. Yukinato, yeah, having problems. Having a lot of problems right there. And Kohide actually already very, very aware and knows that Potem can match up because he plays a lot against uh, Nikojiro. And uh, both are, are actually uh, pretty tight. And Kohide has that matchup knowledge a lot. But that being said, Rigo Yukinato goes for the pod buster. That's gonna be. Oh no! Oh no! Kohide! Oh lord! Oh! And Yukinato going for the. Oh, the butt! The butt! Ah, uh, that being said, here we go with the out. Oh, no! Ah, uh, and the tick pressure makes it so that. Got it. Why not just trash bag? Okay, anyways, that being said, yeah, I cannot send this stuff here. Can I send it here at least? Uh, yes, I can. I did. Okay. Oh, here we go. Again, here we go with the tick pressure from Suzuna, man. Finds the opening, forces trash bag to pop the burst. And here we go with the corner pressure from Suzuna. He's gonna get a lot of damage right there on trash bag. Okay, we're good. And here we go with the slash. This is gonna do a lot of damage. First round goes to Suzura. Okay, no sword throw here. Oh my lord, and that 6 period there from Suzuna, beautiful, he's gonna bring Trash back in the corner. We go with the ram pressure, he goes for the reset. He goes for the extension using the RC. And that freaking cross up, not the cross up, the overhead, very nicely done by Suzuna. I get swept by, oh my lord, and that freaking grab to go, to go and, um, and uh, basically uh, and go through the meteor without getting hit by them. That was really wonderful. Using the invincibility frames of the grab in order to go through the uh, the meteorites. That was wonderful. So, uh, I and okay. good, good, good. Okay, here we go with the far S right there from Suzuki finds the opening. Forces, wow, nice reaction station from a trash bag right there. Wow, pops uh, forces actually uh, doesn't get hit by the golden burst right there from his opponent. Ah, 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 I'm not afraid to keep hitting buttons right there, even though the bomb was right in front of him. Suzuna, I'm not afraid, man. I'm not afraid, I'm not afraid. He gets the grab. Here we go with Suzuna, goes for the empty low. Fails to get the juggle. That being said, Trashback commits to the mix mix, pays off in the end. He's got little Faust to help him. And he goes for- No! That whiffs! Trashback, you are not allowed to whiff this stuff. You are not allowed to whiff, the, whiff these, these combos, man. Come on. 
Anyways, that being said, we go with the bow oh, and the pressure. He was about to get the kill with the mix, mix, mix. But goes for a cross up using the uh, 2D, the uh, jumping knee, and gets the kill. Good stuff. Thank you very much for the follow exiled spirits and welcome to the Brojo. That being said, here we go with the wall pressure. Wow, very nice whiff punish from Suzura gets the knockdown with the Rekka. Ah, he goes for the juggle. Unfortunately, that that, that causes a, a side switch. That was definitely not uh, what he was expecting. Probably not. Ah, that being said, here we go. To, oh lord, and that air to air by trash by very nicely done. He's gonna get the overhead into the spear into the golf, the golf club. Ah, and here we go. Ah, the wall pressure is real. Ah, you go. Oh, no. Oh, my God. And Suzuki goes for the golden burst. You don't want to get open right now. Don't get open. Don't get open. Don't get open. He goes for the quake. Oh, Lord. This is going to kill? Yeah, this is death. Bye-bye. <laughs> Good Lord. Oh, that damage output from freaking Ram, man. That being said, I still don't think she's talking. But I don't know. I don't. I'm just a scrub. So don't, don't take my... my don't take my... Uh, my opinion to account. That being said, real quick, just once again, because one of the matches has been determined, so I need to send. Oh, fuck my life. It's not the. the, the I'm sorry, this is not one. Okay, that being said, here we go with the golf club again by Trash Bag. He tried to go for the. Oh, Lord! And gets hit by the sword throw and gonna get hit by the Calvados. And Wolverine, look at the damage! What is Trash Bag gonna do? Ah, the pressure's real! And. Oh, Lord! Oh, Lord! Oh, my God! God, and Chizula just lets it rip and gives the second match as well. Good stuff from Suzura. Yeah, he... Well, he, he, he made the correct decision, man. He did. Good stuff from Suzura. Gets it. Okay, that being said, here we go on with the next battle. And Suzura already with Trash Bag in the corner. Okay, uh, is everything okay? Again with the Calvados. Look at the damage! Look at this damage! Here we go with the jump in by Tsuzura. He's gonna force Trash Bag in the corner. Trash Bag tries to get out using his head, literally. And here we go with the, with the command grab. There <laughs> we go with Trash Bag, not afraid, man. You run towards me, my little fast is gonna destroy you. That's what you're saying. Very nice. Uh, sword throw against the spear is just gonna kill. No! Too far! Oh, he goes with the shimmy and gets a kill. Good stuff by Trash Bag. Finally puts one round on the board. There you go with duo two. Okay, oh, here we go with the cross up. Trash back not on point right there. Oh, he goes with the Abare. Good decision. Tried to get out of the corner. But Suzura sticks with him like glue. He's gonna get the right guy. He's gonna get the. Oh no, that was a nice burst. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. Oh, Lord, what are these new combos right there from Suzura? Suzura trying to get the... Ah, the jump in. Oh, and that's 6 speed though. Trash bag not going out without a fight and literal hammer on your head. Oh, he tries to get the juggle using the overhead, but no, no one's home. And Suzura gets the uh, jump in he, using the RC, gets the extension. Couldn't quite get the kill, but gets the chip kill. That is good stuff by Suzura. On to the next round. Let's see how this spins out. Ah, Trash Bag, okay, finally finds the opening. Oh, not quite, though. Here we go with the sword throw, man. It's been doing Trash Bag really bad, man. Not gonna lie. He goes for the OTG, tries to get as much mileage as possible. And, ah, I got hit by the wig. The wig, man. Oh, he's gonna get a wall. Oh, no. He goes with the overhead, man. And Suzuda with the conversion, with the recognition. Oh, no. He dropped the cabin off, but it's still, it's still his turn. Doesn't change anything. Here we go with the wall break. Oh, no! Oh, no, he gets grabbed! No, Tsuzura saw right through him and just like this, Tsuzura. So that for matches whose uh, participants have not been decided yet, you cannot access the chat and send preemptive like uh, directions, like, uh, you know, information and shit. For example, what I used to do is that I opened preemptively the matches that I wanted to stream and I sent in each stream, uh, I sent them directives saying, okay, do not start your match because this match will be streamed. But I'm not able to do so anymore. 
because they made it so that uh, until both participants are not decided in a given match, you cannot send uh, chat messages. And this is absolutely horrendous. <laughs> this is absolutely horrendous because I, I have to keep a watch on uh, on the um, on the bracket at every single moment, and it's super annoying. <laughs> yeah, and I don't understand why they made it so. It was perfect the way it was before. Why did I have to change it? I have no idea, but. Yeah, it's really dumb. It's but it is what it is. I have to, you know, I have to work with it. Unfortunately. That means that we go with the jump out and oh lord and Lensing Iki already trying to push Gobo in the corner. Successfully doing so, but Gobo fighting for his <laughs> for his corner life. Okay, oh a little bit short on there trying to entire Gobo. That means that we go to Far P doing a lot of very good things to keep. Uh, Gobo out of Gobo fans out of the oh out of his range, but Gobo fans go for the 2s. Oh lord, and that freaking read from Gobo fans noticing that Takarim was going underneath him and wasn't trying to enter him, just trying to get some more real estate. And again with Gobo fan using the 2s, man has been doing a lot of oh. And here we go with Takarim using the OYRC. Oh, a little bit too far to get the juggle. He would have gotten the kill by the way if he did get the juggle. Ah, that being said, we go to the standing P man is doing a lot of mileage right there to keep Gobo out. Wow, and the 2S man again. This has been working a lot for Gobo fans, but that being said, we go with Takarin using the Lin Sengeki for the kill. There's a kill. Okay, here we go with. Uh, did I send the announcement for Red? I did. Yes, I did. Yeah, yeah I did. Okay, here we go. Yeah, we're good, we're good. Uh, Debbie said, here we go. The corner pressure from Gobo looking actually pretty good. Goes for the Ola DR. No, he couldn't quite get the combo with the D, the dust. This is so unfortunate. And Takarin out of the corner. What are you gonna do? You don't want Takarin out of the corner. Gets the 2H uh, two counter hit. Oh, Lord! And Scott jumping RC from Gobo fans, man. One second, he's upon you. What can you do? Keep. Keep Gobo fans out, man. He's coming for you. That being said, oh lord. Here you go the tick pressure from Takarin trying to push Gobo fans ever so slightly in the corner. Goes for the fake cross up and gets the juggle with the command grab and the follow OTG, man. Takarin looking pretty good this summer up. Goes for the grab. Gonna force the RC out. That being said, he cornered himself. You hate to see it. You have to deal with the pressure, but no, you want to go out of the corner. I am not letting you. Takarin. Takarin, man. The best actual in Japan currently, and Takarin just gets the kill. Good stuff, good stuff. Again, here we go on to the next battle. So far, so good for Takarin. Gets the first match pretty convincingly, and here we go with Gobo fans and Diabari from Takarin. He gets hit though. Oh lord! Ah, he's gonna go to the corner. You have to hold it. No, you don't actually, because he's not here anymore. Okay, here we go with the extent from from Gobo fans using his bar to get to buy some time for Eddie to come back. That being said, here we go Takarin with the correct Abare finds the way out of the corner. Ah, but back. Already back there. Oh, look at that jump in from Gobo. Fans. Ah, gets command grab. You hate to see it. And gets killed. Good stuff from Gobo fans. Gets the first round of the second match. Pretty convincingly, not gonna lie. Again, here we go the pressure, man. And this is gonna do a lot. Go fans looking good. Oh, Lord, and the Abari, man. Takarin, Takarin, not afraid. Oh, gets hit by the invite to hell. Here we go, the frog. Ah, oh, the corner pressure is real, and he gets the command. I wanted that burst so much. He wanted that burst so much, but Takarin didn't give it to him. Okay, that being said, here we go. Oh, no, no entire red there, Gobo fans. What are you doing? Ah, and the take pressure, man. 2K2D, you are going on your knees. Oh, Lord, and... Takarin fights, yo, go for the axle bomb, this is gonna do a lot of damage, no overdrive to get the hard knockdown right there from Gobo fans, but from, from Takarin, that being said, here we go, Gobo fans, what the hell happened? Why did Takarin press a button? I do not know, but this worked really good in favor of Gobo fans, manages to get, get the first match of this second match. Let's see how this pans out for Takarin, is he gonna bring it back? Well, that being said, they're both at the exact same uh, score, so there's nothing to bring back right now. That being said, we go in by to hell and Takari not afraid to get out of the corner just like this. That being said, Eddie is in the house, yo. Oh, he goes for the 
Alpha Dust almost got the bait on the burst, man. But that being said, here we go with the Lens and Geki. RC right there made it so that he couldn't get punished by the overdrive reaction from Gobo. Takarin gets rid of Eddie. He's going for the Arden Sengeki. Oh, Lord. And here we go the Lens and Geki again to get rid of Eddie and the follow up of Gobo fans all at once. Two birds, one stone, and here we go using the rainwater to get rid of not only Eddie, but also bringing Gobo fans closer to him for a combo. Good decision making from Takarin. Definitely aware of the matchup using the RC to make his recovery non existent and uses it to anti air Gobo fans. Good stuff from Takarin. Oh lord! And here we go! Oh, doesn't quite get stopped. No! Who is that in the air? Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's Gobo fans! Good lord! Here we go with the uh, corner pressure. Trying to use Eddie to go out of the air, but no. Okay, okay, here we go. Now, Gobo fans trying to keep. Oh! Takarin in the corner, but no. Takarin says, no, I don't like the corner. Instead, I'm gonna win. This is a far better deal for me. Just like this, Takarin takes the third match of this set. Let's see how this spins out. Mm. Okay, here we go. Ooh, okay, using the oppose right there to try to prevent Takani from using green water to kill his Eddie. Which is a nice decision making if you want. Okay, Gobo Fan's not using his burst to try to keep Takani in the corner. Goes for the aerial approach. Finds the opening with the uh the counter hit. Here we go with Eddie man. Again. Ah, you have to see and that freaking defense, man. That defense from Chekarine. Uh, gets the drill. He's gonna get the wall break. This has been going back and forth, man. How's it going? Still grinding to GST, and here we go with Gobo Fence taking the first round of this fourth match. Oh, good lord! Uh, here we go to jump in. Uh, Gobo Fence trying to keep the pressure, but Takani getting rid of Ede using the 2S or the 2HS, I'm sorry. Uh, however, oh lord, and Gobo Fence almost got the corner pressure still, but Takani was a little bit too far for him to hit, and therefore uses this opportunity to get rid of Eddie. Oh, he gets to jump in. No! Why? 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 Here we go with the rain water. Nope. Oh, good lord. Ah, oh, no. And that follow up, the pesky follow up from Takarina. Tries to go for the entire. Can't quite hit Gobo Fence out of the air. And here we go, Takarina with the uh, bar right there. He's going to get the. Uh, the, the, the. What's called? The uh, juggle and the kill. Gobo Fence absolutely needs this round if he wants to. Uh, stay in the winner's bracket. Let's see how this spins. Oh, but he gets the drill. The Eddie drill. Again, here we go. The Lens and Gekei. Lens and Geku. And the Rainwater Man. And he gets the burst. But that's unfortunately couldn't quite get any follow up because he was too far for it. And you can see Gobo fans using the RC again. Oh, no. He got rid of Eddie though. But it's okay. He got 2K 2D. Oh, he drops to go for a cheeky command grab. That being said, Takarin was on point. Ah, uh, couldn't quite get the 2S2 make. Is a probe safe? Is he gonna get the kill? Let's see. Optimize combo. No, we dropped it! He dropped it, you cannot drop it! Gobo friends! Oh, he goes for the instant dust for the kill. Very nicely done by Gobo fans. Puts the other one on the board. Let's see how this turns out. Okay, okay, here we go. And here we go, the 6P from Gobo fans hits. Immediately, Takarin with a counter hit. Here we go, the opposite. You have to respect. Goes for the close S. Because he notices that Takarin wants to jump out of the corner, actually, to not get command grab. Here we go, the air to air in favor of Takarin. Oh, Lord, what was that? That was so strange. That being said, here we go, my Lord. And the double overhead from Gobo fans. Yo, Shop Jellyfish, thank you very much for the raid. And welcome to the bro, Joes. This, <laughs> this game is a zoo right now. Has it ever not been a zoo though? <laughs> that being said, here we go with... Oh lord! Boom! The overdrive from Takarin is gonna get the hard knocked down. Go for the aerial approach. The safe knockdown. Uh, let me check the uh, bracket real quick, guys. I'm sorry. Uh, yes, I need to. Here we go, Takarin on the verge of taking it. On the verge! Okay, the the next up is gonna be... This is... Uh, what? Second guy. fans, and we have. Huh? Oh, yeah, two Takan Bobo fans. Zoni D. Okay, Zoni D. TY. Then we have Kofi Day, and then some other. Okay. All good, all good. <laughs> Honeywell! Uh, 
freak. Okay, here we go. Win. Oh, Lord. Ah, go, friends. Uh, almost on the verge of dying, though, man. But that being said, here we go. He gets the uh, anti air. Uh, he goes for the fake empty low, and he's going to take it with Among Us. Uh, this is going down to the wires, ladies and gentlemen. Last round with the last match. Who's going to take it? Oh, no. And Global fans get anti air with the 2H. Uh, the 2S, actually. Not the 2 hs Okay, here we go. Goba fans in dire search right now. He needs to get out of the corner. He needs to find the opening. You can see Takarin using the... Oh, Lord! Good stuff. No, couldn't quite get a pose before getting his Eddie killed. It's still okay. Eddie is back already. Oh, gets kid by, hit by the 2HS. This is bad. This is bad. This is looking pretty bad. Oh, the rainwater. And again, man, Takarin, man, preventing Gobo from getting out of the corner, man. It's been working so good for him, man. Oh, he's going to oh, get some knockdown. Try to bait that burst. Ah, oh, what? Oh, no. He failed. He failed his, his jumping setup right there. Is he going to get the wall? No. And he gets hit by the jumping, uh, jumping back. What the hell? Okay. 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 Well, T.Y. is probably, he's probably nerfing himself right now. I think, I, I think he's like, he's like playing soft, I think. Just, just to like, give a chance to his opponent, I feel. But let's see how this pans out, let's see. Here you go with the, with the big freaking, the big freaking, uh, what's it called, the, the, the uh, Vortex. Okay, that being said, here we go, finally, Zoni D got the stain, unfortunately got hit out of the air by uh, T.Y., which made it so that uh, the stain state was taken off of uh, T.Y., T.Y. with the recognition, the entire is right there. He's gonna get the, oh, wall pressure. Yeah, well, Saul, I know, right? It's so strange. I've never seen him play Saul before. Oh, he tries to get the whiff, punishes, but no, man. Oh, Johnny D gets hit. Unfortunately, this is going to do a lot of damage, and this is going to kill. Good stuff. That makes it an incredible good game for anybody who wants to have fun or to be... Yeah, Grand Blue, man, I love this game. I can, I'm can. i definitely going to play the uh, re Rebirth. The Rebirth? Is it Rebirth? I forgot. But I'm gonna play the the extension when, once it comes out. I'm definitely I'm gonna host tournaments as well of it. Let me say here we go with the teleportation from Zonny D. Gets hit by the vortex. Oh, a big counter. This is gonna do a lot of damage. Oh no, he goes for the fancy blue RC combos and takes it with the grab. Very nicely done by Ty. Extremely strong man. Ah, GGSC. Okay, my bad, my bad. I thought I was, you were talking about uh, Grand Blue Fancy Versus. My bad, my bad. Uh, the problem is that the difference between a really good player who runs a lot and a random player who plays only often is not as big as... Oh, okay. This makes it an incredibly good game for anybody who wants to have fun or to begin... Okay, okay, for now. I really love uh, Grand Blue Fence Reverse, so I'm definitely gonna play this shit. Anyways, here we go to take grab pressure right there from... Ah, uh, T.Y. gets in with the Flores counter hit. Ah, uh, goes for... Oh, no! Got hit the first hit by uh, the TP, but unfortunately couldn't quite convert it. But that being said, Zombie Day is gonna get the, uh, the uh, beautiful Nostrovia into the wall break. Uh, almost got the stain state. Oh no! Very good, Zombie Demon. Ah, uh, gets the kill with the Arbiter. Good stuff. Okay, let me send another message. What happened? Oh, here we go. Wow, and Zonny D bringing the heat, man. Definitely bringing the heat right there. Uh, I tried to go for the instant red, but yeah. Uh, T.Y. was already on point. That being said, here we go with the wall break. Zonny D showing his true strength. Uh, no entire right there. This is unfortunate. Ah, gets hit by the far HS. Unfortunately, I see why he couldn't quite convert right there. He goes for a grab. Again with the grab. Ah, oh, no, Johnny D gets it. Ah, this is unfortunate. This is death, actually. Kaboom. Ah, Johnny D was playing so good up until now. Up until he actually got put in the corner. Oh, Lord. Are yeah, you talking about Narmea? Yeah. Uh, Narmea is DLC, I don't know. Well, she was DLC in the, the first version of the game. So she might be DLC in the, the second as well. But it's not, it's not, it's not sure. It's not 100% sure. Here we got the jump in. And T.Y. gets the hit with the 4HS, man. 
Gets the kill. And TY is up 2-0. to zero. Let's see if Zondi G can actually bring it back. Okay, and here we go with the pressure from TY already forces Donny to pop the burst. Gets hit by the Vortex counter hit yet again. And here we go with TY and the optimized combo. This is a lot of damage. Goes for the Tyrant Ray! For the wall break. T goes for a regular take pressure. Man, oh, he's gonna get the extension. No, he drops it though, but it's okay. Gets a grab for the kill. Okay, final round. Possible final round for Zombie D, man. He needs this if he wants to stay alive. Okay, he gets a same state. Okay, it's out of the corner using the TP. Oh, okay, here we go, Zombie D again with the stain state. Can't quite get something started. Oh, okay, got the hit. Gonna get the extension station. Using the juggle system, and he's gonna get the Nostrovia. Nostrovia! Uh, she has a parry, yeah, but it's not the same as, uh, not the same as, uh, uh, it's, it's not the same as Biken at all. It's, it's not automatic. Here we go with the freaking wall break right there. Finally, Donnie D brings it back. He needs this one if he wants to stay in the winner's bracket, though. Oh, Lord. Here we go with the juggle. Good stuff from Donnie D. Things are looking pretty good. Ah, uh, no entire right there from Donnie D. I to see it. Ah, I guess it again, counter hit, man. Yeah, I think he's uh he's playing easy. Uh, he's playing soft right now. He's not he's not taking out his his mains right now unless like he's playing somebody who's really who manages to to defeat his his soul. I think it's a handicap he's doing probably. I think. Ah, okay, here we go with Zani D, getting out of the corner. Oh, and gets hit by the Vortex. And here we go, a TUI takes it, a clean 3 version of her parry. In which case, and it only parries like uh, moves who are high, not lows. So it's not the same thing at all. Mm. So it it only parries moves which are high, and uh, if you don't, it only the X version, actually the parry, the, the follow-up hit comes out right away after uh, it parries. The other one are like timed parries, it's not the same thing. It's kind of uh, hard to use. Maybe trying to get some tournament XP as well with the second yeah problem, I guess. Being said, here we go with Takarin trying to go with the close pressure right there. Guess the burst made from Kohide. And Kohide gets out of the corner using the kick flip. Here we go with the uh, cannon drill. Very nice swift punish right there from Kohide. Gets the juggle. Gonna get the wall break. Here we go with the grab from Kohide. And Kohide gets a quick first game right there. Okay, and here we go with the corner pressure from Kohide. Gets the grab. Ooh, yeah, it's not very easy. And also, uh... Narmaya has uh, two stance. She has two stances, and depending on which stance you have, all of her move sets like changes. So she's actually pretty complicated. <laughs> but she's uh, she's fun to use though. I really liked uh, using her. I main her for uh, for a good six months until UL came up. So I yeah, she's pretty fun. I'm probably either gonna play. Yeah, I'm probably gonna play her as well in the uh, once rebirth relink. I forgot the fucking name. Once it comes out, I'm probably gonna play her as well. Yeah, uh, once yeah, uh, once the uh, the update of like your Grand Blue comes out, I'm I don't know, man. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't know if I'm gonna move completely to Grand Blue or if I'm gonna continue playing Guilty. I really don't know. But both like ah uh, man, like I really like Grand Blue the the very first game. So there is a big chance that I go back to it, and especially if there's like there's also Street Fighter Six coming out. Street Fighter Six, I'm gonna play whatever happens. But like I probably only have room for one more sub game I guess and I'm gonna have to choose between Guilty Gear or Grand Blue I really don't know what I'm gonna do I really am I'm in a pinch right now <laughs> that being said here we go with the pressure from Kohide oh lord and Kohide gets the hit with the jump 
using the RC. And again, man, Targaryen, man, with them freaking two HS. The two S, actually. Oh, Lord, and he bades the, the, the Nashante. That use of the RC, though, from uh, the guy is really crazy good, man. We go with the tick pressure, man, from Takarin. He gets hit with the quick dust using the RC. He gets... Oh, no, he couldn't quite... He, I don't know if it was intentional or not, but he gets the hit with the 2K2D. Tries to go for the snail using the RC to make it safe. Just the standing P and the... Uh, Lensen Geki and the kickflip for the kill is by Kohide. Good stuff by Kohide. Oh, Kohide takes the second match as well. That was really, really, really fast. And Takarin on his last legs right there, on the verge of getting sent to the loser bracket. Mm. Okie dokie, Breads and Cookie. And here we go with the juggle by Kohide. Oh, gets a juggle as well. And here we go with the wall break. Kohide with the very, very hefty uh, life lead right there. What is Takarin going to do? And Takarin here oh, going very, very closely with the challenge, but unfortunately gets hit by the standing uh, H. Okay, and potentially final. Oh, match of this set. Let's see. Here with the tick pressure from Kohide gets hit by the rainwater and gets juggled out of his life. Oh, Lord! And Takarin baiting that gold burst, man. The gold burst that Kohide absolutely loves to do on Wake Up. Can you go again with the snail? Takarin looking pretty good. Ah, uh, against the forest. Ah, uh, no entire right there. Ah, uh, gets hit by the... Oh, the Trovao. And here we go. The new combos by uh, Giovanna. Kohide is going to get the wall break. Oh, gets hit with the cannon drill. Goes for the quick dust. And Takarin. Oh, almost died there. <laughs> what is going to be the Oki? Ah, uh, there's no Oki actually. Because it wasn't... Oh, a hard knockdown. Oh lord, and Kohide, man, content to just take, yeah, to build some distance. Oh no, he gets hit by the standing pin to the wrench and Geki got stuff by Takarin. Stays alive. He's gonna be able to bring it back. Here we go, the kick flip, and Takarin using the 2k to low profile that kick flip and make it whiff and then punishes it with the grab. That was really beautiful. Here we go with, oh my lord, the conversion, man, Kohide, good stuff. Gets the wall break, he's gonna get the positive bonus as well. Here we go with the cannon drill. And the quick dash for the mix mix. Ah, uh, careful there, careful there to Karin. Oh no, Takari dies with this burst. This is so unfortunate. And uh, let's see how this pans out. And TY does indeed use Sol once again. Let's see if this is going to be enough to contain that crazy player that is Tuzura. We shall see. So that definitely very, uh, very uh, knowledgeable on the Sol matchup, I guess. That being said, he gets the entire right there. Already in the corner. And he with the tick pressure, man. Oh, and that aerial grab. Oh, very nice far slash. Didn't quite, didn't want, didn't quite, uh, what's it called? Believe in the punish. And he said, here we go. Oh, and the, uh, so not going with the side switch. He's going to get the... He was gonna get a pretty nice wall combo. He's gonna get the uh, positive bonus as well. Kitsura checking with the two HS right there for potential vortexes. He goes for a far combo to try to not get bursted on. That being said, didn't really require it because uh, I think that TY was already resigned to not use his burst. That being said, we go with the sending game, man. Good lord. Oh, and gets grabbed. We go again a grab, maybe? Nope. Oh, very nice. Oh, that back dash from Tsuzura, though, not gonna lie. That was crazy. Oh, no, the wake up DP. That being said, Tsuzura, I think he tried to grab. Uh, tried to grab TY, but I think he grabbed a little bit too early. That being said, it is not over. Tsuzura does have a burst. Goes for the ram slam, but nobody home. Woo! Woo! Woo, this is gonna hurt. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Okay, Tsuzura content to just keep the walk. Oh, no! No! Oh, and that grab, that aerial grab was crazy. Good stuff from TY, man. On point with the aerial grab, not gonna lie. That being said, he gets hit right there by the... Oh, what is this? This uh, side switch. I'm sure it's not. He doesn't want it. It's not intentional. I'm pretty sure. 
That being said, here we go with the very big wall combo, man. The, the corner combo. Here we go with TY content to try to oh, find the opening and not overcommit. That being said, here we go with the far S for oh, the opening. Daru buff goes farther. Indeed. Yeah. That's unfortunate for the side spin. And that being said, Suzura gonna take it with the Ram Slam. Good stuff by Suzura. Gotta get the first map. Is uh, T.Y. actually sticking to his guns, man? Okay. Let's see how this spins out. I... I suppose I... I guess that T.Y. is gonna stick with uh, Saul up until he's like down two, two matches. And then if he... And then what, if he's down two matches, then he's gonna switch to either... Giovanna or Chip. Here we go with the DP, man. Ah, and that Abari, man. No, grab. Oh, here we go with the lows. No, oh, no, sir. Here we go with the, uh, the sword. Oh, no, and the ball, the, the bandit revolver. You hate to see it coming out from nowhere, catching your bag dash. Okay, here we go to the out of the corner. Finally, goes for the sword throw again. Oh, wow. And you not afraid to just run straight out of the corner, man. And the pressure is real. Okay, here we go. Finally, Suzura. Why, Dara? I think it might have been intentional, actually, right there. Oh, to get the corner position. But that being said, here we go with T.Y. gets the kill using the RC. Very nicely done. And T.Y. not out of it yet. Here we go to Far Slash. Very nice with punish right there from Suzura. Again with the side switch. I think... Yeah, I think Su Suzura is not... Right? Uh, he's not... Uh, what's it called? He's not used to the... Not used to that that buff of Daro, probably not. Ooh, Lord, and that jump in though from T.Y. Ah, very nice with punish again from Suzura. Uh, okay, I don't think he could have gotten more juggle right there. Very nice DP from T.Y. He's gonna get the juggle. He's gonna get the RC, the RC extension from the Bandit Revolver. They're looking good right now. Get the burst and just. Run straight 2k2d for the kill and just like this man. Oh, uh, just like this both opponent up one to one Let's see how this spins out Again here we go with the juggle man. Ooh, 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 ooh. Here we go with the bandit revolver Wow, here's a TY forcing the burst man. Uh, I'll try to go I suppose for a Aerial grab was a little bit off timing wise. That being said, here we go with the ransom and the wall break. Far slash 2H. 2H. Uh, it's not trying to go for the grab, but TY with the timely bag dash right there was able to not get grabbed. Oh, drops the combo though. Oh! And you're going with the, oh, the wake up. The wake up super from Suzuna gets the kill. Okie dokie, breads and cookie. On to the next battle. So that needs this one if he wants to go up to the one, which would be absolutely fantastic for him. Oh, Lord, and that just defend right there from TY, man. Oh, gets opened by the forest counter hit. This is going to do a lot of damage. Boom, boom, boom. Here we go with the Fafnir for the wall break. Ah, damn it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, TY is definitely catching up to... Oh, Lord, that forest. Oh, try to go for it. And near to air, unfortunately, gets hit. And yeah, as you can see, man, TY getting acquainted, getting used to that, that use of the Rick of Tizura, consistently just, uh, just blocking every single instance of instant blocking, uh, just blocking every instance of it. I guess it butter forest though. This is gonna do a lot of damage. Woo, nobody home, but still manages to find the punish of the with punish attempt of Tizura. Ah, and yeah, Tizura getting a little bit desperate right there. Ah, uh, this is gonna do a lot of damage. It's not gonna kill by any means. Uh, again with the forest. Oh, gets hit by the. Ah, uh, you hate to see it. And just like this, T.Y. is gonna go up. Oh, or not? No. And oh, okay. Ah, uh, thankfully for. Oh, into that, I guess. I guess air grab, man. That was crazy. Good stuff by T.Y. Up two to one. What is Suzura gonna do? We shall see. Good lord. That was really, really well played. 
Okie dokie, we're just here we go to far slash number one home. And T.Y. just content to take, yeah, to put distance between him and Ram and just occasionally just running up and pressing buttons. Ah, and here we go with the jump in. Ah, that missed time to, to medium made it so that T.Y. could get his hand on the momentum right there. Push his Suzuki in the corner. Ah, yes, and by the second hit of the, the Rick got his ammo. Uncharacteristic. Ah, here we go with the 2HS counter hit. Suzuki going for the side switch using the RC. Goes for the... Ah, the overhead for the reset. Oh, look! No, too far! He was too far to get the juggle using the uh, the overhead. And here we go, T.Y. using the vortex to get out of the corner. Wow. Ah, 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 just the fan. Uh, uh, uh. Ah, that was unfortunate. Before T.Y. gets hit by the third hit of the wreck. Uh, uh, and this is enough to kill. Good stuff from Suzura. Okay, Suzura definitely needs this one if he wants to stay in the winner's bracket. And again. Oh, okay. Oh, that juggle, though. And here we go, the extension. This is gonna do a lot of damage, by the way. Boom! Get out of here! <laughs> this is not definitely annoyed. Annoyed by the just defense from TY. Nah, no entire right there, but it's still okay. Okay, TY on the. He really, really was close to get killed right there. Very nice use of his standing K for the entire. Ah, yes, open, man. Oh, and the grab! Okay. No! That was so close! I don't I don't know if that was a good idea, yeah. Oh no, he had to kill! Oh no! Just like this! Yes, I finally sealed the deal. It's a bro joke up, are you doing a train? <laughs> no problem, man. Okay, that being said, here we go. No, and TY just sticking to his guns, man. Sticking to Soul. Here we go with the uh, 6P, man. Ooh, and the far slash though. Ah, here we go with the air and air to air, man, from TY again using the... Ah, learn the forest. You hate to see it. Very nice. Jump in right there from Suzura. Oh, look, and that just defend in the row. Nice 6P right there from Suzura. Gets rid of the revolver. Oh, very nice shimmy. I don't know if it was a shimmy, but it definitely worked in his favor right there. Very good, Yabari. Oh, get off of me. Very nice grab, and Tuzura should be able to seal the deal with the Ram Slam. Okay, on to set point. Is T.Y. going to be sent to the losers? We shall see. Oh lord, we go to four slash again. Two HS. Oh, yeah, Tsuda looking for the DP from from Ty. Definitely looking for the DP. Ah, too far. Too far to live. Uses URC to get out of the corner. Catches. Oh, that bag dash attempt using the close S. That being said, Ty not out of it yet. Okay, no DP from Ty. Ooh, that far S. That, that, that 6 uh, S, I'm sorry. Ah, and the vortex will go underneath the normals of Suzura. This is, you hate to see it. Ah, 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 ah. Is he gonna get the side switch? Yeah, but it's not gonna be enough to kill. Ah, and the DP man. Let it rip. No! Oh! going down to the wire. That to the wire. Ah, you hate to see it. Oh, no. That's just like this. Wait. Wait for it. Yes, and Susan actually sends T.Y. to the loser's bracket! Make it through the grand final and uh, even more. Let's see uh, how the progression of the bracket is going to go. Uh, from there on, that being said, here we go with the... Oh, I have some more stuff to do. Sorry, guys. I go with a main player. Okay, that's cool. We go Amato, then we have T.Y. Yeah. Very good. Okie dokie, we're good. <clears throat> and here we go with the 2S man for the freaking kill by Akira takes the first. First. First kill. 
just one sec here. We have two right here. Tap that in here. Okay, should be good. Hmm. Okay, we're good. And here we go with the Tutsugeki by Go. Gets the wall where he's gonna get the positive bonus as well. I guess the jump in goes for the horizontal, the vertical. Uh, oh, Mr. Dolphin. That being said, Mr. Dolphin got hit by a dust. And Akira with the side switch. Go for the kill. Good stuff by Akira. Takes the first round, the first match. Uh, quite convincingly, let's see if Go can adapt and bring it back. We shall see. Go to 2S, no one home by Go. Oh, Lord, and that reaction, that reaction station, man, from from Akira immediately sees, sees the, sees, oh, Lord, ah, uh, Tutsugeki time. No one home, you're gonna fully charge. Anchor forces Akira to pop the burst. The golden, oh, I hope you didn't press a button. Oh, Lord, oh, no, you hate to see it. You hate to see it. Here we go, the oh, the wall pressure gets hit by the 2HS counter. Well, that 2HS just normal hit. That did a lot of damage, but the way we got the Erika sound, but no one saw him, and Akira gets a kill. Good stuff by Akira gets the first round of this second match. We go to jump in by Go, manages to get the, the, the knockdown. Ooh, no one home right there. Ooh. Oh no, no punish on the full kill. Here we go with the tick pressure. Nice use of the RC right there. No 6P! Oh lord. Oh, oh lord. Here we go with Go! Gets. Oh no! Gets. Oh no! And that golden burst got blocked. You hate to see it. And Totsugeki gets 6P. And just like this, Akira, man. Up 2 to 0, man. Good lord. That is crazy, man. Akira out for blood. Literally. Literally out for blood. Good stuff from Akira. Here we go on to the third match. Potential last match of Ghost's career. Entire career. You lose in the Brojo Cup, you cannot play any other tournament anymore in Japan. It is the tournament you cannot afford to lose. <laughs> Obviously, I'm, I'm, I'm lying. But, but that being said, here we go with the corner pressure by Akira. Wanting to keep Go in the corner. Oh no, this is a badly timed overdrive though. Yep, this is unfortunate. Here we go with the overhead of Kishu. Oh no, you couldn't quite get the follow up. Yeah, you see it? Ooh, gets it by the 4S from Akira. Akira trying to bait this. Actually, it managed to do it. Oh no, and go try to go for a fully charged nut, but Akira was on point. Here we go to jump in again. Akira cannot use a lot of. Yeah, he couldn't use like uh, special attacks because. His blood gauge is almost full, gets hit by the closest, and this should do with the uh, with the uh, Beyblade to catch his opponent on the way down. Being said, here we go with, oh lord, I get already with his opponent in the corner. Uh, goes for the Konsetsu. Air to air, no one's home, and the 6P on the way down by Akira once again. But he's gonna blow! Okay, it's okay, go got Akira in the corner. Uh oh, boo! What? Using the downtime of the freaking, uh, of his blood, uh, using the screen freeze of, of, um, of, the sc of the screen, basically to see that Go had committed to uh, a hit and then using the overdrive to punish it accordingly. That was beautiful. Oh, and again with the 6 people for the kill. Akira takes it a clean three. Macho Hagiara versus a Macho. Let's see how this pans out. Ah, I'm dumb as a kite. I'm in the side of the boat. You know, what am I doing? Okay, we're good. I'm in the side. Just, I don't know. 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 送ってしまい申し訳ないです今全部適切な女を送ったので
一番最新のメッセージを読んでいただきえっとえっ、ー、とまあいただければと思いますごめんなさいああちょっといろいろミスしちゃったのがあってあ大丈夫今萩原ベチブマーケットこれもいるよね I wouldn't have to worry about this if freaking Tonino was. If they kept, kept doing what they did up until now. Good lord. Anyways, that being said, we go with the wall pressure from Amato gonna get the wall break. Thank you very much for the follow, Beats FGC, FGC and welcome to the Bro Joes. And here we go with the quick. Oh lord, and that. That burst was. Made it! Good stuff from Amato gets the kill in the second round as well. He needs this one if he wants to get the first match. Very nice kill of the minions right there. And Hagyara walking straight into a, a hammer time. Oh, very nice recognition right there from Amato that Hagyara actually was able to catch that uh the 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 trumpet. The trumpet! We go to wall break, the wall pressure. Oh ah, very nice closes right there from Amato gets the double juggle with The mix, mix, mix. The schmix. We got the banana to keep the pressure. No one on the hammer. Okay, minion time. Have to hold it. Have to hold it. Good stuff from Amato. Uses the golden burst. Even has a little Faust. Ooh, that, that grab was crazy. And Agyara goes for the cross up for the kill. Good stuff from Agyara. Gets the first match. Very convincing. That being said, it was very, very tight too. Good stuff, good stuff. Let's see. On to the next battle. Oh, good lord. Okay, here we go with the wall pressure and Hagiano with the 6P. Very nice. Amato trying to get out of the corner for the Oh, what happened with this? Okay, actually, Hagiano recovering before the uh, overdrive of Amato had time to reach him. Goes for a double throw for the kill and gets the first round of this second match. Is there any Zato one player in this tournament? There has, but he is unfortunately eliminated. Yeah, unfortunately he is. He made it up until... Up until the fourth round, the third round of the losers, yeah, and then he uh, lost to Go, the main player. So yeah, that's unfortunate. But he did, uh, he did make a pretty nice run. Not gonna lie. That being said, here we go on to the next round, and Amato trying to force the pressure on Hagiara. Gonna get the wall break. Is he? Yes, he is. Gonna get the kill. That was a sick, sick conversion right there. Good stuff from Amato. Is the kill. <laughs> Good stuff from Amato gets the kill. Again, okay, here we go with the 2k2. The Agara gets the uh, big, big, big counter hit. Oh, nice recognition right there from Amato. Oh, Fortunately for him, he had a. Oh, and he will benefit from a golden burst. That being said, we have two minions. No more minions, actually. Uses the quick. Side switch from the Scarecrow to get out of the corner. Tried to bait the overdrive, I'm pretty sure. But Hagiara not, not biting at all. Ah, gets it by the weight. Oh, goes again with the side switch of the Scarecrow. But Hagiara on point with the block, man. That was crazy. Good Amato using the... Uh, oh, no! Gets it by the weight in your ATC. And this is gonna be death, actually. Good stuff from Hagiara. Seals the deal on the second match as well. Good stuff, man. Holy freaking lord. Okay, 2-2-0. Two, two, Amato needs to get three matches in a row if he wants to stay in the tournament. Let's see if he has it in him. Big, big counter hit right there. Start of the round. From Hagiara forces the burst upon Amato. Gets hit by the 2k. Thank you very much for the follow, catch spiel. Snack, I, I, I snatch spiel. <laughs> And welcome to the bro jump. And here we go with... Oh, Lord! Good Lord! Ah. Yeah, I'm also trying to get rid of all of them minions. Gets the knockdown, fighting for his life in the corner. Oh, no! Too many minions. 
Ah, and here we go with Hagiara using the quick dust for the kill. On to potentially the set point of this encounter. Hagiara with the cross up. Oh, unfortunately gets hit by the dive of Amato Amato with the corner pressure. Got little Faust. Get the haircut. I'm gonna give you an afro. I'm gonna light this afro so bad. He's got the fire on the afro. Oh, tried to go for get for grab. Unfortunately, the explosion of the afro made it so that couldn't quite time it correctly. Okay, and here we go. The oh, Lord, tried to go for grab. Unfortunately, I got a bag dash exactly at that moment. And he had a very nice combo right there. Oh no, he made it. The YRC. Oh, and here we go with the tornado. Not the tornado, the, the meteor, right? Again, little Faust, look at him. Look at him going left and right. Little Faust has been triggered. Do not trigger Little Faust. Go, go, indeed. Very nice awareness right there from Hagiara using the RC to uh, not commit, well, to um, to uh, make it so that he recovers faster and doesn't get hit by the trumpet by everybody. Never realized Faust's command grab was haircutter scissors. Yes, it is. And here we go with the 2K2 for the kill by Hagiara. Takes it a clean 3 to nail. Oh, this time, okay. Well. Ah, and the names are reversed. Uh, yay. Please respect the names. Ah. Aki. Aki. Versus T.Y. Alright, sorry for the wait. And here we go. Akira versus T.Y. And T.Y. pops the, uh, the, G the Giovanna. So let's see how this pans out. Okay, very nice stuff from Akira using the jumping D to lay his way on the ground. Go no one home on the jump in of Akira. Ah, T.Y. using the cannon drill to maintain the pressure. Woo! We go to YRC. Akira. Oh, try to get out of the corner, but gets grabbed thanks to the uh, quick. What's it called the uh, just defend from T.Y. Ah, here we go with the DP. Akira wanting. Ah, oh, again gets grabbed. Very nice recognition right there from T.Y. Oh lord, gets open again by the standing S. A very nice back dash by Akira. Uh oh, what happened? I think he did a close S, yeah. Oh, actually not. Woo! And here we go, the fully charged dust. Oh, catches the first attempt from TY. Oh, and here we go with the command grab. Akira not out of this yet. Gets the kill. I couldn't quite get the OTG kill. Go to uh, the back dash. Lord. Oh, and the 6P for the kill. Good stuff by Akira. On point, man. Puts one on the board, man. Okay, let's see how this spins out. Okay, no entire right there. And you're going with the conversion station from TY. Ah, catches his back. That's using the clone. Close S. 2S. No one home. Very nice. Oh, no, no punish, man. This is unfortunate. Ah, gets the hit with the. Oh, he tried to go for the blue RC. The blue RC. Uh, instant overhead combo. Uh, Surprise, Mother Humpa! Again, we go with the very nice tech right there from Akira. I goes for the jump and gets the hit. Oh, no, you tried to go for a quick dash. What's happening? Oh, and here we go the grab. TY not out of this yet. Goes for the grab again. Ah, uh, goes for the grab again. This is gonna be dead. Good stuff from TY, man. But good attempt right there from Akira. Almost made it, man. Good stuff. Holy fear, Lord. That was really close. TY takes the first match. That was spins out. That was so, so close. So, so close. So we're going to <laughs> round start 6 man. That's all you need. Oh, again, here we go with the clone and TY just checking them. Kukio attempts right there. Good stuff from TY. Use it again, man. Resets using the... Oh lord, man, that dash grab, man. This is so treacherous. And here we go with the kill. Using the overdrive. Taishita mono dana. Okay, here we go with. Oh my lord, round starting a Sante counter hit into a wall break combo. Look at this damage, man. On Nago Ryuki, nevertheless, man. That's crazy. We go back full Q into uh, Beyblade for the opening. Again with the grab by TY, good stuff. Wow, and that delayed, did delayed overhead, man. And just like this, TY moves 2 to 0, man. Good lord. 
good stuff by T.Y. He's the second match as well. And Akira on the verge of getting eliminated. What is gonna happen? Wow, the 4K. But your blink. Ah, gets hit by the 2D. You hate to see it. Getting the drill with standing S. Couldn't quite get anything, but it's okay again with the kick flip. Oh, Nasante. Round Nasante counter hit with the juggle. Ah, this is gonna do a lot of damage. Not gonna kill. Thank you, Proration. Thank you, Guts. Ah, very nice Abara right there from Akira. Finally gets something going on. Ah, yeah, but yeah, his blood gauge is definitely too high right now. He cannot. Ah, he gets hit by the aerial overdrive. And just like this, TY is on set point right now. What is Akira gonna do? Here we go with the check. Oh, and again with the check, man. You cannot fool you on this, man. Again, here we go. Ah, again with the check this time around from Akira. Tries to go for a command grab. Oh, Lord, and that close as well. No, didn't get the juggle. You hate to see it. Here we go with the kickflip. Ah, the delayed throw, man. You hate to see it end. Oh, Lord forces the, the burst. Good stuff from Akira. Immediately burst. He would have died, by the way, if he didn't. And just like this, the grab, man. TY. This guy is from another world, man. <laughs> this dude is from another world. Batro, 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 Batro. Tagarin versus Agera. Tagarin Axel versus the beautiful Jacko. Let's see how this pans out. Oh, you served the round with the 2k. No one's shown, though. Oh. Get back to neutral. Finally, first minion is out. Immediately gets killed by Takarin. And Takarin doesn't want to have anything to do with the, the minions. Very nice juggle right there from Hagera. Gonna get the corner pressure. Okay, Takarin using the FD to force. Uh, actually, not just the FD, but the FD combined with the just the defend to push Hagera out of. Uh, well, completely out of range so that they cannot continue their corner pressure. Okay, here we go with... Oh, Lord, that pressure, man. Here we go with the snail. I get up in the corner themselves. Then Sengeki. Yeah, Takarin checking with the 2k in order to catch the 2d attempts from, from Hagera. But that being said, unfortunately, Hagera gets grabbed. And Takarin manages to take the first round of this set. The very first round. Here we go with the 6HS counter hit. This hurts like a mother humper. Very nice use of the minion to hit Takarin. Oh lord, look at the pressure, man. Finally, Hagera forces the burst from Takarin. Oh, gets hit by the 6HS, though. Here you go with the rainwater. Close S. Oh, that trade, though. Ooh, air to air in favor of Hagera. Probably wanted to. The, the 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 overdrive i do believe goes for the quick burst or the quick dust and rc extension for the kill good stuff from hagara okay final round of this first match with 6p but takarin didn't commit to any aerial attack so they didn't get in tired oh very nice 2k to low profile the aerial attack uh, attempt from hagara and punishing him at the same time we go, oh my lord, the Jets defense are real. Okay, we go to OTG. Rensen Geki to keep him out of range. Snail using the RC to make it safe. And ah, rainwater for the Gale. The chip kill. Good stuff from Takani. Takes the first match. Okay, and on to the next battle. Okay, very nice decision of Takarin to get rid of the minion. Ah, wakes up Golden Burst. Golden Burst. Okay, here we go. Ah, very nice 6P for... Uh, oh, Lord, wake up. You hate to see it. Oh, no. And here we go. Hagiara using the burst to get out of harm's way. Ah, gets hit by the 2HS, though. Again, 2HS. Which is doing the work, man. Ah, and the rainwater catches Hagiara, man. 
Like, I not, uh, didn't believe in his uh, conversion potential right there, I believe. And here we go to grab. Here we go to grab. Oh, Lord! And I uh, get, yeah, I guess, the IRC bait right there. Puts one on the board. Actually takes uh, the lead in this particular match. Very nice air grab from Takari. Goes for the close slash. Didn't quite get the buzz, the, the the juggle. And here we go, the empty grab by Hagiara. So the corner pressure. Oh lord, you hate to see it. Oh no, couldn't quite get the juggle, but it's okay. Hagiara gonna get the wall break. Doesn't have any bars to get uh, the uh, hard knockdown though. Ooh, that check right there from Takari. Here we go, the 2HS. No rain water. Very nice. Awareness right there from Takarin to get rid of the minion as soon as he's on the screen. A very nice confirm right on the Twitches and right after the snail. Ah! And Hagara. Oh, so what I believe happened is that Takarin thought that Hagara was gonna th go for a side switch, and that's the reason why he didn't. Uh, he didn't burst right now because probably if he bursted too early, uh, Hagara would have had time to go behind him and then even block the burst so he thought yeah anyways i is gonna try to side switch so i'm gonna bur delay my burst i'm gonna delay and i'm gonna burst once hagela is on the other side but the thing is that probably hagela knew that takarin was gonna go for this so hagela immediately went for combo to surprise takarin and not give him time to burst at all and just kill like this and that caught probably takarin off guard and that's what resulted in hagela taking it even though takarin had a burst so that's my uh by understanding of the of the the, the previous um, sequence that we had. That being said, here we go with a very quick first round of Takarin right there. Okay, here we go with the pressure from Hagiara. Gonna get the grab. Oh, gets the minion juggle right there. Look at the damage, man. Look at the Lord. <laughs> Lord. Okay, ah, yeah, this is gonna be big. Good stuff from Hagiara. Immediately takes it back, man. Holy grief. Just like this, we are in perfect harmony right there. One round apiece, one match apiece. Here we go, the jump in. No one home, and here we go, Hagiara using and getting uh, the tick, the, the shimmy. And here we go, the corner pressure. This is gonna do a lot of damage. Ah, Lord. Ah, Lord. Oh, Lord. Here we go to grab Hagiara, man. It goes for the empty grab. It goes for the empty low and then the grab. And just like this, Hagiara takes the lead. Good Lord. I get on point, man. On fire. What is Takarin gonna do? We shall see. Oh, very nice air grab right there from Hagiara. Okay, doesn't even use... Oh, the pressure of his uh, minions. Finally uses it right now. Ah, uh, no jump in right there. I guess hit by the Lensengeki. Not even, he was. He had time to block. Very nice. Uh, I guess we'll get the jump in. This is gonna do. Uh, this is gonna be a very precarious position. <gasps> oh no! Where's the. Where's the Elysium Driver? You hate to see it. And the air grab, man. Hagiara getting ready, man. Hagiara can feel it. Hagiara on the verge of eliminating Takarin from the tournament, by the way. That would, that would be crazy, man. That The upset, man. Very nice experience there from Hagiara. Goes for the reset. Ah, goes for the low. Uh, Takarin doesn't really know what to do right there. He's gonna have to eat it. Just eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Oh no! And Takarin is eliminated from the tournament by Hagiara. Cookie Kohide versus Tsuzura. Here we go. Good stuff. Definitely looking forward to this one. Kohide, I never seen these guys fight against each other. I know that Tsuzura won a previous. Uh, Brujo Cup against RX, but I never really saw him play against Kohi. Uh Not on stream, that is, so I don't really know uh, if this ever happened before, but we shall see. Who is going to take it so far? Kohide is definitely in the lead. Okay, okay, here we go, the wall break and the immediate tech pressure, the tick pressure man, and the perfect for Kohide on a freaking steamroll right there. Okie dokie, bridge and here we go with Kohide and the 
the corner pressure. Try to get out of Tsunada tried to get out of the corner using the uh, flying overhead. Unfortunately, Kohide and Giovanna have a lot of speed. It's very hard to get out of their reach. Uh, and Kohide gets the burst bait and he's gonna get the kill with the jumping H. Good stuff from Kohide. A quick first first to zero. Well one to zero for now. Good lord, that was really quick by the way. Okay, and on to the second round. Let's see if Suzuka can bring the necessary adjustments to try to bring it back. Here we go to far slash. Ah, uh, try to throw them. Oh no! Try to throw them swords, but Koide was already among them. Among us. And here we go with. Oh lord! And the. Ah, uh, the optimization station right there from Koide. Ah oh, lord, yeah. Suzuka having troubles keeping up, I'm not gonna lie. We did up one round one match. What is Suzuka gonna do? And here we go with the corner pressure already, man. Oh, okay, here we go with. Oh, oh! And Koi did with the golden burst. He loves it. Okay, this is really bad for Suzuka. He's gonna get a lot of damage. Ventania into the wall break. Okay, okay, here we go with Kohide trying to oh get the kill. Ah, uh, Tsuzura finally out of the corner. Finally getting something going on. Uses the RC to extend. Probably wants that positive bonus, I guess. Or just the corner pressure. And I think he blocked. Yeah, he probably Oh no! And Kohide recognizes recognizing that he blocked and immediately RCs and grabs Tsuzura out of his block. Very nicely done by Kohide. Oh, okay, we're going potentially the final match of the set. We shall see. Oh, okay, the oh, the corner pressure. Koide jumping out. And landing on Suzuka. Okay, cannon drill. Ah, oh, good lord. Ah, he's gonna get the, yeah, side switch again. No wall break, no wall splat. I said it again, man. Kohide relentless, man. He doesn't want Suzuka out of his reach at any time. And a quick perfect buy. Kohida, this is really one-sided. There we go, the hard knockdown. Ah, Tsuda trying to go for the grab. Kohida doesn't want anything to say. Ah, 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 ah. Ah, the pressure, man. The pressure is real. Okay, finally, Tsuda trying to fight for his life out of the corner, man. Oh, okay, very nice, too. HS, he's gonna get... Ah, oh, almost got a conversion. Gonna get the... Oh, the wall break! With the heavy knockdown. Ooh, that closest counter hit, and this should do. Good stuff. Finally, Tsuzura, man. Finally, Tsuzura. Getting one round. Okay, here we go. Ah, again with the tick pressure, man. Ah, very nice part. S. Gonna get the conversion. Uh, the, yeah, the conversion. Okay, here we go with the wall, the corner pressure of. Ah, oh, no, Tsuzura even uses the burst to keep the pressure on. Tries to go for the grab yet again. But Kohide on point. Kohide gets the wall break. Forest. No, and the grab yet again. And this should do. Yeah, this is gonna kill. And just like this, Kohide takes it a clean 3 to nail. 3 to snail bill. Good. TY versus Hagiara. TY, man. Finally getting his Giovanna out. Well, he did uh, take her out uh, when he was playing against uh, his Akihira. So I think that his deal was to basically not use uh, either Giovanna or Ship as long as he was not sending the loser bracket. As soon as he got sent the loser bracket, he was like, nope, I'm not playing anymore. I want to win. <laughs> Yeah, because T.Y. up until now was playing Sol in, in this tournament, I mean. But as soon as he got sent in the losers, he, he immediately, like, used Giovanna. Very nice whiff punish right there from T.Y. gets the first round with a perfect. Okay, here we go to 2 TD. Oh, Lord, and the double dash right there from T.Y. Gonna get the corner pressure, Ooh, or not. Okay, very nice kill right there of Dominion. Oh, Gary good. Oh, ah, uh, the far HS. Two far HS counted. This is gonna do a lot of damage. Look at the damage. Good lord. Ah, uh, gets clipped by the 2K2D. 
Oh lord, and the 2k, 2k for the kill by TY takes the first match. Very, very good, Vincent. Let's see how this spins out. Okay, round start with Nasante, man. Only TY. Okay, here we go with the wall pressure. Good stuff from Haiki, uh, Hagiara. Gets a very nice pressure right there. And here we go, Dominion pressure goes for the grab. Wow, DOTG man. DOTG for the kill. Oh lord, and the recognition from TY to get out of the corner. But gets clipped by the 2k. Good stuff by Hagiara, man. Actually taking one round off of TY. This is this in itself is actually pretty impressive. And thank you very much, the kid, for the follow and welcome to the bro jokes. Again, just like this, I oh, guess with the tech pressure from TY man. Ooh, gets rid of both uh the pressure of Hagiara, but also Dominion, and just camping like this, man. Just standing, not pressing a button right there. That was impressive. There we go. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Okay, good stuff from TY. Gets clipped by the 2D, though. Oh, no, and that grab, though. Unfortunate for Hagiara. Ah, he uses the 6 HS to uh, catch the backdash at them from uh, TY. TY using the YRC to get out of harm's way. Very nice grab right there from Hagiara. Ah, goes for the uh, delayed cross up, uh, for the delayed overhead. Wow, man. Oh, no, Shari. And he gets a kill with a Trovao. Good stuff by TY. Okay, one round apiece. Would be good for Hagiara to get the kill there, to get the, the, the next round. Ooh, you're good. Though. Oh, no. Wow, that low profile though. Ah, that jump in though from Agia. Things are looking pretty good. Gets the OTG. Careful. Ah, and the 2D catches the back dash from TY. TY out of harm's way. Ah, very nice stick right there from Agia. Ah. Man. Oh, they're both whiffing so many buttons right there. Oh! Oh, and that freaking dash grab. Ah, and oh, nope, no button's home again with the tech man. Hagiara man doing his homework. Oh, he tries to go for a grab. Wow, wow, no, he couldn't quite get the juggle. No, and TY gets the birthday for the kill. That was so, so good, man. How did he know? How did he know? That was crazy, man. That burst bait was crazy. Good stuff from TY. Okay, here we go. Immediate counter hit. Oh, start of the round. Both opponents forcing the other one to pop the burst. Okay, here we go. Dominion pressure. Good 2k duty right there from Hagiara. Ah, oh, lord. Ah, uh, catches the bag. That's using the minion, man. Tries to go for a tank again, but... Oh, Lord, the Nasante, man. Ah, and unfortunately, he gets hit by the cannon drill counter hit. Ah, TY trying to go for a blue Roman cancel. Uh, overhead. Okay, goes for the empty low. OTG goes for the quake does for the kill. Good stuff, bro. Hagia again takes the first round of this, uh, this match, but... It's still has some problems sealing the deal. Okay, here we go. The pressure is real. Very nice 2k right there from... Wow, and that bag dash from TY, man. That's crazy. I guess hit by the, uh, the cannon drill. Woo! Good stuff from TY, man. With punishers are real. Air to air, man. Oh, that low profile. Wow, really? That's crazy. Wow! Uh, TY in Dire Straits though, not gonna lie. Ah, uh, no 6p right there. You hate to see it. Oh! And the grab for the kill. Okay, TY on set point. Let's see how this spins out. Oh, and the 6hs counter hit. You hate to see it. Wow, the damage though. What? For that combo though. Good stuff from Hagia. That was a beautiful combo. Oh, and the 2D counter hit, man. You hit to see it. Very nice grab from Hagia. Dio main here. Rooting for TY to teaching these mix up spammer lessons. Indeed. Oh, and that air grab! 
Wow! Hagyan using a burst safe setup right there to ensure the win. Good stuff from Hagya. Good stuff. That was amazing. That was really good. That was really good. No, that was... I, I, I'm legit impressed right there by Hagyara. Good stuff. Good stuff from Hagyara. Okay, here we go. Though, yeah, it's not out of the wood yet. TY definitely out there for blood. Probably not happy to have lost this one. And get the kill with another kill, but the, the wall break with the overhead. The, the overdrive, the overhead. Very nice. That's the same right there. Oh, and then back there. I get on point, man. Goes for the delayed overhead as well. Wow. Goes for the overdrive. Elysium driver. Yeah, let's see how this spins out. I tried to probably bait an overdrive. Ah, oh, very nice use of the of the minion. Just can Oh no! Agiara! Agiara, why? Why you had it? You could you do the six P or did you had to do something, man? You hate to see it. Oh, this is so unfortunate. Very nice Asante. Okay, and with the 2K 2D. Not like this, Hagiara, but it's okay, okay, it's not over till it's over. Not over till it's over. Oh, here we go, then Asante. Very nice just defense from both uh, players, by the way. Ah, uh, that was a big Nasante right there, counter it. Oh, <laughs> good lord. Ah, and the kickflip for the save again, the kickflip. Wow, lord. Thank you very much for the follow, your PS, and welcome. Oh, no, no, no. Why? I can't finish your plate, man. Please. Good lord, finish your plate. Oh my lord. <laughs> You can't let, you can't let Chiwai live, you cannot! Oh good lord! Oh this is crazy! Oh this is crazy! I might get paid! Oh good lord! Oh yeah, this is looking bad. This is really looking bad. Not gonna lie. Ah oh, yeah, here we go. Ah oh, yeah, this is death. Oh no! Hagyara-san, mo honto ni... Yeah, that was good. That was a summit as well. Oh yeah, FAB is definitely popular. FAB is not only popular as a player, he's also popular as a commentator over here. Kohide here too. Yeah, he is. He is. Uh, he, he is he's gonna, you're gonna see him in the next match. And Gobo as well. Yeah, obviously, yeah, Gobo. Because he won Red Bull. Before, before Red Bull, I don't know if he was that famous though. Uh, but yeah, he's definitely famous. Lots of very famous uh, Japanese players here. Blessed. <laughs> yes. Anyways, here we go with, finally, we are in the Losers Final. Sorry for the wait, ladies and gentlemen. This is the Losers Final. Suzura versus TY, and so far, so good for Suzura. Gonna get the Galvados. Get out of here. Big, healthy damage right there. Ah, uh, Suzura probably tried to go for an empty grab. Unfortunately, he kind of messed up. Didn't get hit by the Nasante, at least. Tried to get the hit with the 2HS. Unfortunately, no one was home. And Koide going for the quick dust. He's gonna get the kill with the well wall break. That damage though, yeah. And Jiro as well, yeah. Jiro definitely uh, famous as well. Are Gal uh, Gobo and Jiro still ready? Yes, of course they are. They're playing uh, re uh, consistently, regularly as well. Jiro more than Gobo though. Yeah, I think he is as well. Yeah, wouldn't surprise me. He does have frosty faustings on his uh, Twitter handle. So that probably means that he intends to go there. No promises though, but yeah, it's, it's probably a guess. That would be a, a really, really sweet. I love seeing Jiro going to international, you know, conventions and shit. Oh no! No, he had the burst. He did. He did. Uh, he had the burst. This is one for. Oh, gets the hit though. And here we go with Suzuna getting the wall break. I prefers to reset the. Yeah, he preferred to keep Ty in the in the corner though. Ah, uh, here we go, T.Y. Ah, T.Y. getting the kill with the chip. Very nicely done. First round goes to T.Y. Let's see how this pans out. Good lord. T.Y. definitely on point. And here we go on to the next round. And so far, so good for T.Y. Already got the quarter positioning. Gets the double overhead pressure. Combined with the wall break, he's gonna get the positive bonus. Nice for S. Counter hit right there from Suzura. Aiming to get out of the corner. 
Ah, very nice with punish again from TY man. Definitely on point on this. And that air grab with the follow-up. Is this gonna yeah, this is gonna kill actually. Yo! Actually getting the extension station. It's not gonna kill. Oh it is! Okay, it is. Good stuff from TUI man. Calculating man. Good stuff. It's UI up one game, one round. Ah, and that grab, man. Good stuff from TUI. Here we go to take pressure. Oh, the 2D counter hit, man. You hate to see it. This is gonna be death, actually. That is a freaking. <laughs> that is a fucking. This, that is a freaking speed run right here. Good stuff from TUI. Gets the second round, the second match as well. Let's see if he can seal the deal. Oh, good lord, we go close S, no one home. Again with the, ah, uh, that whip punish, man, from TY, definitely on point. Woo! Into the, woo, gets it by fully charged dust! <laughs> TY trying to bait that, that burst right there. Here we go, the big cross up. Ooh. Oh, nice punish right there, he even catches the back dash. Good stuff from Tsuzura getting the corner pressure. Goes for the overhead. Nope. Oh, almost punished it. Ah, no juggle right there, but it's okay. Tsuzura got the... Oh, Lord! Goes for the delayed overhead, and this is gonna not kill, actually, unfortunately. Here we go, the... Ah, uh, safe jump. And here we go, YRC by TY. Gets out of the pressure, but is bagging it right away. Ah, oh, bad 6p right there from Tsuzura gets it. Oh, Lord. wow, wow, wow. Oh, and gets it by Densante from the kill. Unfortunate for Tsuzura. And we are on set point. That was a very, very, very quick loser's final. TY not, not losing any time right there. This is crazy, man. Ooh, here we go with the 4k, man. Ooh, Lord. Okay, and TY with the pressure. Oh, Lord. He's going to get the wall break with the overdrive. Ah, uh, it on his last leg, he does have burst. Ah, uh, so I tried to go for the air to air, but so that I was not anywhere close, and this is gonna do. And here we go, a clean 3 to nil by TY. Grand finale, Kohita versus TY, let's go! Thank you very much for the follow, Lurch, and welcome to the Bojos. Nope, no Geo Mirror is gonna be uh, Geo versus uh, Chip, actually. I like two dog fighting lord. lord and just the far s right there from Kohida to catch the uh the oh lord wake up dp by chi Wai chan oh no oh, no no anti air right there from Kohida, but still okay it's still oh okay very nice on something right there he's gonna get the juggle Kohida out for blood gonna get the wall break with the overdrive what's gonna be the mix oh and the wake up dp again why not why not? Why not? Why not? Here we go. Oh, Lord! Ah, Lord, and that far is counter hit, man. Ah, wake up, DP. I don't like this. Ah, this is not good. And she might gonna get the optimal punish right there. Okay, here we go. Positive bonus for everybody. This sounds like a terrifying matchup. Yeah, I agree. And the kickflip for the kill by Kohide. Good stuff from Kohide. So just for a reminder, TY needs to... He needs to uh, to win two sets in a row if he wants to win the Brojo Cup. Whereas Kohida is in the winner's bracket, so he needs only one. And being said, here we go with the pressure of TY. Wow, did you see that, man? TY just running after Kohida, man. Kohida absolutely loves to backdash, by the way. You'll see him backdash a lot. Oh, and here we go with the grab for TY to reposition Kohida in the corner. Ah, uh, no nice Ante. Nice Ante here. It's the air. And Kohide back with a deep pressure. Ah, he's gonna get the wall break. That's 2k thrice. Yeah, I know, right? That was crazy. Oh, Lord. And here we go with the grab for the kill by TY. TY so definitely going a little bit more, uh, yeah, a little bit more discreetly, <laughs> if one might say. Hey, Lord, Kohide just the start of the round. Ah, trying to bait that DP. Ah, this is huge, though, for Kohide. Kohide, ah, with the... Ah, uh, tick pressure. That being said, TY has some tick pressure of his. Oh, catches the back dash with the 2k, the 2s, 2hs. Ah, uh, not for sure for Kohide. Tried to get out of the corner using the uh, walk under, but was a little bit too far. Uh, oh, Lord, and that back dash should... Oh, now, okay, good stuff from Kohide. Oh, he gets the corner, the, 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 the counter hit. No entire right there from Kohide. This is bad. Okay, here we go. The whiff punish. 
And that freaking... Oh, that conversion! That was crazy from Kohide. The cojones on this man. The conversion of this man. This is crazy. First match goes to Kohide. With uh, in extremis, uh, uh, an absolute last minute uh, overdrive right there from the standing cake. That was crazy, man. Good stuff from Kohide. Okay, here we go with a deep pressure from TY. Ah, it goes for an immediate uh, overhead. Oh, very nice uh, kickflip guard right there from Kohide. He's gonna get the Alpha Blade with the wall break. Oh, again, here we go with the immediate overdrive cancel of Koide is not going to get the kill because this overdrive sucks. <laughs> well, the damage of this overdrive sucks. The overdrive itself is okay, but the damage is really ridiculous. Okay, here we go with the round start Nasante by Koide, of course. Okay, here we go. Both opponents using their own tension, man. Their own burst, I'm sorry. Oh, Lord, again with uh, the chase from TY, man. Oh, he's gonna get the. Oh, Totoy, come on! Good stuff from TY on the verge of taking the second match. Ah, uh, no entire. Ah, uh, good stuff from TY. Good patience. Waiting for uh, Tiwa, for Kohide to throw that uh, Nasante out before committing to dashing forward and uh, punishing him. Good stuff. Go with the kick flip. Right, like getting ready. Getting used. Ah, Lord. Out of pressure is real. For us. Ah, and that convert. My Lord. Ah, that confirm was crazy from Ty, man. And here we go with uh, the infinite pressure. Ah, very nice back dash right there from Koide. Ah, base the DP. Wow, that was funny though. And Koide not out of the woods yet, still. He's gonna get the wall break though. Ah, and that air grab for the kill. You hate to see it. Good stuff from Koide. Ah, oh, Lord, yeah, Kuida getting a little bit too angsty right there, I feel. Ah, and the wake up DP from TY, man, you hate to see it. Ah, oh, very nice tick throw right there from Kuida. Was for the. Oh, Lord, immediate overdrive for the wall break. Not gonna kill, though. And I, I predict a kick flip. <laughs> I called it out. <laughs> called it out. <laughs> Oh lord, I called it out. Okay, here we go with the take throw right there from Kohide. They were looking good right there. Try to bait the bur the the DP. Oh, that take. Oh man, that challenge man from TY. Good combos right there. He's gonna get. Oh, no wall break. Very nice challenge right there from Kohide. Too far to get the Roman cancel. This is so unfortunate. No, the Nasante out of nowhere. Commentator buff, yeah. <laughs> Ah, and here we go, the tick pressure, man. Coming to the curse. Ah, very nice block. Ah, yeah, try to block this, though. Oh, Lord. This is death? It's not. Oh, no! You hate to see it! Good stuff from TY, man. He's up 2-1. to one. He's gonna reset the bracket. This is why Kyan is so good as commentator and player. You can just call these out. <laughs> yeah. And accessorily, and also, I, I have played against both, so... I. I Kind of sometimes know their tendency, but yeah, Koide more than uh, than Ty though. Koide I played him a lot, so I can more or less sometimes tell what he's gonna do. Anyways, here we go with uh, the uh, neutral back on the neutral. Very nice six P right there of Ty right in the pressure of uh, of Koide man. He's going completely ham goes for the grab. Oh, okay, here we go with Koide trying to get that overdrive, real overdrive, but nobody was home. Okay, and here we go with ah yeah the overdrive. This should kill. No, it's not even gonna kill. Man, this this super man. <laughs> you can't kill anybody with it. Man. And here we go with the immediate alpha blade. Very nice grab though by Koide. Goes for the kick flip. Ah, and gets hit by the two P man. 
Are we gonna get a corner? A uh, corner. Uh, bracket reset. It certainly sealed. It seems like it. Okay, two to one for Kohide for Ty. Okay, finally Kohide getting something uh, going on. He goes for the spir spiral arrow. Ooh, uh, that clash though. I know, wake up overdrive. Is this gonna hit? It is! Oh, but it goes the other way! You hate to see it! Glad I didn't miss Grants. That's good to hear, Shrill Track, man. Much appreciated. Much love, much love. And immediate confirm right there from TY into the overdrive. Oh, good lord. And here we go with TY, man. Ah, here we go, looking flip. Ah, very nice uh, with punish right there from. Uh, from Kohide, but yeah, T.Y. doesn't let up, man. You cannot. Oh, he's trying to go for Shimmy. That would have worked if T.Y. didn't have any bars, but this is going to kill. Good stuff from uh, T.Y. And just like this, the bracket has been officially reset by T.Y. We are going on to a second set of the grand final. It is not over till it's over, ladies and gents. We are going on to uh, the second part of the grand final, and both players have been sent to the losers. This is Grand Final Bracket Reset. Good stuff. Oh, freaking lord. Okay, reset. Is T.Y. gonna take it yet again? We shall see. Grand Final, this is a reset. Okie dokie, Bridget and Cookie. Both opponents are both in the loser's bracket. A very nice 6 period there of Koide in the pressure of T.Y. Oh, again with the 6 feet counter this time around. Almost got the juggle, couldn't quite get it though. Kohide goes straight for the overdrive to secure a uh, hard knockdown. T.Y. Uh, really out here not playing Geo. Yeah, I know, right? Well, I think he doesn't like the mirror, which is understandable. I hate the mirror of my character as well, so... But uh, I think that... Um, he probably played Kohide previously in other tournaments, because they, they, they meet each other like all the time. And I think that it might be the case that Kohide actually manages to defeat T.Y. more often when uh, in a uh, uh, geo in a geo mirror than if it's geo versus uh, versus chip very nice backdash right there from kohide gets the kill with the otz okay kohide not out of it yet but yeah i would have rather seen ty with uh, with uh with geo as well not gonna lie anyways here we go with the pressure corner pressure of ty man ashimoto and the immediate confirm into the overdrive man kaboom ototoy come on Come tomorrow! Oh lord. Oh man, man. T.Y. T.Y. never presses back, man. <laughs> T.Y. is always going forward. It's crazy. And here we go with the Ototoy Kamo for the kill. <laughs> and just like this, T.Y. takes it with a perfect. Good stuff from T.Y. One round apiece. Oh my lord, he's getting used to the kickflips as well. What do you want to do, man? What are you going to do? Oh, and here we go with the wave punishes, man. T.Y. is definitely on a steamroll. Ah, wakes up with DP, though. Nice wave punish from Koide. Ah, oh, good lord. T.Y. not pressing back. Truly embodying the ship mentality, as he should. <laughs> My lord, and here we go with the pressure, man. The challenge from T.Y., man. Even on RCs, this is crazy. Nice wave punish again from T.Y. Going for the aerial approach. And immediately using your drive. Oh, Top Toy, come on! But it's gonna be the mix. Ah, uh, again with the overhead and the kill. And just like this, T.Y. takes the lead 1-2-0, man. 1-2-0. What is gonna happen, Kohide? What are you gonna do? Ah, uh, good lord, far S, man. Far reaching S. Ah, uh, good lord, and here we go the tick pressure, man. You hate to see it. And again, if my lord, the. <gasps> Oh, the confirms of this man. <laughs> 6k RC is the thing to do, yeah. It is, it is, it is. You go the Gamma Blade and infinite pressure, by the way, and you gotta open. You hate to see it. Oh, lord. And the conversion with the perfect. Is that the second perfect that TY has, like, in two back to back? And here we go, the kick flip. No perfect this time, at least. Okay, here we go with Ah, Kohita finally biting back. And here we go with the confirms. Going for the sick uh, the sick throw. <laughs> Going for the, the, the safe jump. Ah, nice stop from Koide immediately. Uh, cancels into the overdrive for the kill. Finally, Koide bites back. 
He needs the, the next round as much as possible. He absolutely needs it if he wants to stay in his head in the game. Ah, and the wake up DP yet again by TY, man. Been working quite a bit. Here we go, Gamma Blade. You have to hold it. And again with the two jumping 2k. And the confirms, man. As soon as he hits you, it's boom. It's Ototoy Kamo. Ah, TY going deep. Ah, he wants to burst. He almost got it, by the way. He didn't believe it. Here we go with the kickflip. TY trying to go for the grab. Good stuff. He gets the quick dust. And he's gonna get the wall break. That was a normal hit. Yeah, I know, right? That's crazy, right? It is crazy. Yeah, TY is sick on confirms. This is gonna kill, by the way. Good stuff from TY. Oh, Toto, come on! And TY takes the lead. 2 to 0. What is Kohide gonna do? Poor Kohide, man. He was up, man. He was up all this time. and uh, But we'll see, we'll see. It's not over till it's over. Let's believe. Believe in Gio. Let's believe in Giovanna. Oh, here we go. Good stuff. Kohide managed to force uh, TY to pop the burst. Here we go to close S. No counter hits, though. <clears throat> ah, <Amo. laughs> ah, this is gonna kill. Good stuff from Ty. Uh, from Koei gonna get the first match of this third match. The, the the first round of this third match. Okay. Oh lord. What the hell? Four H. Four. Six H at the start of the match. This is crazy. Here we go. Ty going ham. And again with the confirms, man. He's been 10 to 10 on this one, man. This is crazy. And here we go with the... Ah, oh, infinite pressure, but... TY got a little bit too angsty. Ah, this is gonna do a lot of damage, by the way. I'm gonna kill by any means, but... At least it's gonna be some decent damage. Ah, good stuff. Going low immediately and the overdrive for the kill. Good stuff from TY. This is tournament point, ladies and gentlemen. Kohide needs this one if he wants to stay in the tourney. Wow, that was a big counter hit. Hey, Rigo with the far. Far confirm. No DPs here. Here we go with the overdrive. Kohide not out of this yet. They're believing. Oh no, he tried to go for a grab, but no, he did it a little bit too early. You hit to see- Wow! And yes! Ah, Kuid is still in the race. Puts Finally puts one on the board. I was scared for the, for him, like, for a moment. Okay, one to two. It's still possible. It's still doable. Let's believe in Kohide. A nice 2D. Okay, here we go with the pressure. Oh, no. I tried to go for Nasante, but TY didn't buy. Well, that was an unfortunate burst, but it's still good. At least he didn't get punished for it, but... Ah, here we go with the overhead. Oh, nice grab, no, nice back dash right there from Kohida. That was great. Oh, Lord. Oh, I hope you didn't press C press. Ah, yeah. TY. TY definitely smelling Kohida wanting to wake up DP. To wake up. Ah, good. Stop. Ah, oh, he made it the first. Yes. Yes. Kohida still in there. Kohida still in there. He just need one more. One more. And then, like, momentum wise, it will be entirely in his favor. He needs one more. And TY knows that he needs just one more. That's why TY is gonna go all ham right there. He's gonna go super offensive. You can expect TY to wake up DP a lot during this particular this particular um this particular uh match. You can expect him to wake up DP if Kohide ever gets his turn back. <laughs> which is probably not gonna happen. Hmm. Ah, uh, this is infinite pressure by the way. Yep, you'll have to hold it, you have to hold it, have to hold it, have to hold it. Ah, good lord. And this is, this is death. Okay, tourney point. Tourney point number two. Let's see how this pans out. If Kohide gets a knockdown, I can guarantee you TY is going to wake up DP. <clears throat> okay, ah, the pressure though. Ah, nice to Sante. Ah, he didn't. Okay, I lied. It's a little bit too far though for uh, TY to want to wake up DP, I feel. Anyways, that being said, here we go with the auto toy. Come on! Okay, here we go with the pressure. Oh, nice. Just defend, man. Just block. Uh, DP. No DP. DP. No DP. Wow! I lied. I lied completely. Okay, guys. We have to come on. Give your energy to, to, to Kohide, man. Oh, no. He went for the kickflip. No. No. The freaking overdrive. 
<laughs> and just like this, McCoy Day refuses to die, man. Two to two. This is hot as freaking hell. Good lord. Going on to the last freaking match of this freaking tourney, man. Look, here we go. This is the last match. Let's see how this goes. Very nice. Okay, here we go. Koi Day doesn't want to die. It's going. It's going on. <laughs> nice stuff from Kuhito. Noticing that he's backed actually a wee bit too much and that TY is taking advantage of it. Nice whiff punish right there from TY though. Oh no! And here we go with the overdrive. Kohide pressing some buttons in the pressure. This is unfortunate. What's gonna happen? Out of pressure. Oh, very nice jump out. Oh, good stuff. From Kohide not out yet. He's gonna get a, a positive bonus of his own that he desperately so needs right now. Okay, let's see how this pans out. Oh lord, really? He's gonna get it! Oh, is he gonna get it? No. Wait. Wait for it. It's not over, it's not over, guys. It's not over. TY has two bars. <laughs> no, he did. He did. No, oh, he went for the overhead. It's not over, it's not over, it's not over. Oh, 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 shit, guys. Tournament point. Tournament point. Kohide brought it back. He brought it back. Is he going to be able... Oh, yeah, yeah. Tio is definitely going to play slower right now. Okay, he goes for the cross-up. Tio goes for the cross-up. Here we go with the juggle. He's got the corner positioning. Jumping 2k. And he gets the freaking counter hit yet again on... Oh, the Sukiyaki, man. This is hot as freaking hell. What is going to happen? What is going to happen? Here we go with the Sukiyaki. Ah, this is death. Yeah, Koi is going to hold on to his verse, obviously. Okay, guys, last round of the last match, man. This is crazy. Oh, no. Aren't you I noticing that Koi did just backdash way too much, man? Ah, oh, and again, man. Koi did, man. Okay, here we go. Not over. No, I guess it by the 2D counter. Hit. Okay. Oh, no, that was your Q. That was your Q, Kohide. No. He gets grabbed. Wait, wait, wait. Not over. Not over. No, that back is no. That back is no. That back is no. I, I don't agree. I don't agree with... I don't agree with... With Kohide using bar right there. I really don't. Okay, he's gonna get the positive bonus, but no. Oh, you already... The DP. No. It's not over. Ah. <laughs> Kohide almost had it. This is crazy.